Let love be without hypocrisy. Abhor what is evil. Cling on to what is good. Be kindly affectionate to one another with brotherly love. In honour, giving preference to one another, not lagging in diligence, fervent in spirit, serving the Lord. There is no you or me anymore. It is us. You guys represent each other, hence we need to treat each other like God gave it to you. And when God gives you something, He, want, he will want to see how you are the steward of it. Okay, there are many examples in the Bible. Okay, Abraham and his promises, Moses and his mandate, the parable of the talents and so forth and so forth. Love from the center of who you are. Don't fake it. Run for dear life from evil. Hold on for dear life to good. Be good friends who love deeply. Practice playing the second fiddle. Don't burn out. Keep yourself fueled and aflame. Be alert servants of the master, cheerfully expectant. Don't quit in hard times. Pray all the harder. Alright, second, bigger. Make him bigger than all things. Make him bigger than all things. And often of times we are lost in our marriage here and there. And at those sensitive times, who will be our compass? What will be our compass? Our raging emotions, most often are negative. Our advices from friends and social media, most I give you 50-50, better odds than Coco. We need to find out what is bigger than our ego our situation, our persons, and that is Him. When the Bible says He must increase and I decrease, it is for a reason. That is to steer us, steer both of you to the bottom line of holiness. Give me a chance to show that you can be Well, open your eyes and see the way I see Cause all that I want is for you to be happy with me Indeed, this is a wonderful moment where I get to ask the question, who gives this woman in marriage to this man? I do. Sir, you can give me. Okay, wonderful. Let's proceed. In the name of God, I, Suresh, take you, Shati, to be my wife. To have and to hold, from this day forward, for richer, for horror, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, until we are parted by death, this is my solemn vow to you. In the name of God, I, Sushi, take you, Suresh, to be my husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, until, uh, until we are parted by death, this is my solemn vow. Okay, I hope I've represented everyone well, encouraging you both on this arduous journey. Once again, thank you. Uh, and like the Star Wars team today, I'll leave you with what the Mandalorian would say. This is the way. Alright, or what the Bible would say. Okay, better is one day in your courts than a thousand elsewhere. Amen. Shitty. I give you this ring. Sign up for my vow. And with all that I am, and with all that I have, I honor you in the name of the Father, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs>